Welcome to Karakara. Completed in July 1885. It's a train station on the Beenleigh Line south out of Brisbane. In September 1885, it became the Thania Junction and the step off point to another early railway. G'day, I'm Pete, and today we're going to explore what's left of the Bow Desert Railway Line. In 1877, a rail line was proposed that would have run from Goodna to Logan Village. This route would have had an almost 3.5% grade and also required a new bridge over the Logan River. The line that was constructed from Bethania was already south of the Logan River and was actually shorter. The first section from Bethania Junction to Logan Village was opened in September 21, 1885. Initially, the trains were mixed, passenger and goods. Then in 1929, a dedicated passenger service was provided using rail motors. I think they would have looked a little bit like this one. Friends today. Just north of where the line crosses Stegbert Road is a parcel of land called the Ballast Reserve 219, or the Buck and Ballast Reserve. It's a 166 acre lot that was first used in the early 1880s the site of the quarry that all of the stone ballast was sourced from. It was used again around 1911 for the construction of the Logan Village to Canungra Line. We'll get to that one in another episode. Material was quarried on and off here until the 1970s by Queensland Rail and the Main Roads Department. Today it's a bushland reserve. Logan Village train station. Between 1885 and 1888, this was the end of the line. When it first opened, it consisted of a siding, a couple of yards for cattle and pigs, a cream shed and a passenger platform. Timber from Canungra was also loaded here and sent north of the mills closer to Brisbane. Today there's not much left. Part of the platform, some hardware and some rail.
Apart from Logan Village and Bow Desert, there's nothing left to show of the other stations. Waterford, Buchan, Jimboomba, Cedar Grove, Woodhill, Verisdale and Glen Eagle all had yards and cream sheds and basic passenger facilities, and almost all are now on private property. This is the only picture I can find of those stations. This is Glen Eagle Station. I can only imagine the others were similar to this. On May 1888, the line was completed to Bow Desert. It remained profitable till the mid 40s, with the popularity of the car causing less passengers to use the service. It continued as a freight line until May 1996 when Queensland Rail decommissioned the line. In the early 2000s, a group of local businessmen, with the help of a government grant, attempted to recreate a tourist style service from Bethania to Bow Desert. It was only short lived with a derailment and some track vandalism causing the venture to fail. Thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed this episode, hit the like button and consider subscribing to the channel. That's about all I got for now. Be safe and we'll see you down the road.